mission here is to promote, present, and preserve African American arts and jazz. And, and we do that through exhibitions, through telling the story of North Omaha through the eyes of arts, culture, entertainment, and socially. We work a lot with Girls Inc., a lot of your local schools, and of course we're trying to like branch out even more. It started about 10 years ago and it, it opened as a culture arts center. This center is used for celebrations of milestones, anniversaries, wedding receptions, political campaign receptions, community gatherings. So it's really a combination kind of just like jazz. It's all mixed up and, and entangled, but it makes sense. There's a lot of programs that we have when it comes to just our exhibit that we have going on right now, which is a permanent exhibit, but we always have art exhibits that kind of interchange throughout the year. We want to kind of present that to our youth. And then we also do Jazz After Five, and that's every first and third Friday. And that's gonna be your local musicians. But a, a lot of history in terms of just musicians, national artists coming through Omaha and finding place right here in this 24th and Lake Street corridor. Through the civil rights unrest, uh, this area was really, it was challenged. It was uh, pretty much destroyed during that time of the 60s, the, the conflict between community and police. And so now we're trying to figure out how do we find our way back to even make it better, to make it stronger and build the infrastructure that it can stand tall and be relevant and necessary for contributing to uh, making Omaha uh, and the state of Nebraska a great place to live, work, and play. We want people to feel, touch, taste, and see and being able to hear the, the essence and the energy of a original art form that we call jazz that was created uh, really here in the United States, in America. We want to encourage folks to come and experience that. And as we say, come get it, all that jazz.